The city of Boston is celebrating the opening of its first new firehouse in three decades. And as WBZ's Lisa Greshi shows us, it was built with the long term health and safety of firefighters front of mind. A ribbon cutting decades in the making. And it is so important that we make sure that our first responders, our frontline workers, have the supports and the tools necessary to do their job and to do it uh, with honor and integrity. This is the brand new $23.5 million state of the art Engine 42 Rescue 2 District 9 Firehouse. This is something precious. The first new firehouse in more than 30 years. I can see the smile on all the firefighters' faces. It's just an awesome feeling for us to take this building over. Designed from start to finish with firefighters in mind. Health, safety, and wellness of our firefighters was at the core of how we designed this firehouse. Complete with in-house training opportunities around every corner and at every height. Plus a sparkling kitchen, gym, and sleeping quarters. Debatably, the most crucial part of this new firehouse is this decontamination area where firefighters can stay suited up, rinse off here, take their gear off, put it in the wash to free it of any toxins. There's so much that they've put in here for, for safety for firefighters. Jack Kelly, a retired firefighter, knew the old firehouse well. His brother-in-law, who has since passed away, called it home. It would blow his mind, you know. I could just see him sitting up there in that couch. The new firehouse may be replacing the one built in 1952, yet the legacy of all the firefighters who passed through lives on. The four plaques right over here that, that bear the names of members from previous firehouse who died in the line of duty will remain on this firehouse as a reminder of their sacrifice. And though it's the first new firehouse in all these years, it won't be the last. Next up, Engine 17 in Dorchester. Officials hoping that breaks ground in December. Reporting in Roxbury, Lisa Greshi, WBZ News.